I, J.B. Pritzker. J.B. Pritzker is now Illinois' 43rd governor, and he's laying out an ambitious to-do list. CBS2 political reporter Derek Blakely saw the pomp and ceremony firsthand and joins us now live from the state capitol. Derek. Erica and Rob, Illinois' new governor, Democrat J.B. Pritzker, is now officially on the job. But while Pritzker certainly made news today, others made history. No, everything is not broken. After four years under Governor Bruce Rauner, who complained loudly about Illinois' poor business climate and tax burden, J.B. Pritzker says he wants to be a salesman for what's right in Illinois. In 2019, we must begin a new century with a new maturity and enough foolishness to believe that we can make a difference in this world. And Pritzker vowed a different tax system in which the wealthy pay more. The current tax system is simply unsustainable. Others have lied to you about this fact. I won't. The future of Illinois depends on the passage of a fair income tax, which will bring us into the 21st century like most of our Midwestern neighbors and like the vast majority of the United States. Meantime, incoming Lieutenant Governor Juliana Stratton made history. I am proud to stand before you as our state's first black lieutenant governor. And she called for bridging geographical and cultural divides throughout the state through common concern. I cannot be my best self if I am not working for you to be your best self. As for state controller Susanna Mendoza. Don't even think about moving anywhere else. This is where you want to be. But she's thinking about moving politically to become mayor of Chicago. Springfield, not necessarily where she wants to be. In her remarks, Susanna Mendoza didn't even mention that she just happens to be running for mayor of Chicago. Now tonight, all the action moves to the state fairgrounds for the inaugural ball. And there's been a rumor all day that a surprise musical guest is on the bill. We don't know who it is. The governor's spokesperson won't say. But one rumor has been it might be Paul McCartney. That's right. I have no idea if the rumor is true, Rob and Erica, but I will say this. If anyone can come up with the cash to yeah. pay Sir Paul to party, <laughs> J.B. Pritzker certainly can. That We're is. live outside the governor's office. Derek Blakely, CBS2 News. That would be a huge get if that was the truth there. Thank you, Derek.